fight someone. But as someone who's like 5'2", I'm not ready to fight someone. So just ignore what I just said. As you can tell from the title, this video is about the line, I'm not like most girls. If you've been reading for a while, then you know this is a super popular line and I literally cannot take it. I'm gonna go into my thoughts about this line and why I don't like this. I might go a little feminazi on this, so sorry, not sorry. First things first, let's think about it this way. I'm not like most girls. What does most girls mean? All girls are different. So what do you mean by you're not mo like most girls? There's a lot to define a girl and they're not all the same. When I see that line, that line usually means I'm sporty and I don't care about my looks. Well, guess what, man? A lot of girls don't care about their looks. But then also, guess what, man? A lot of girls do care about their looks. I like books, but then other people will have different interests to me. So we're different from each other but that doesn't mean I'm like one of a kind super unique all these other girls are the same I'm the one gen out of the entire group no I don't appreciate authors grouping everyone who's not a main character together because some of us in the real world aren't main characters sometimes I like to think of myself as a really cool side character that everyone wants a story about but never gets one so we're not the main character I'm not the main character sometimes but that doesn't mean that I'm like everyone else and that doesn't mean that all these other girls are like everyone else. Humans are complex creatures and you know what? Sometimes I think I'm the only real human here and everyone else is robots. But that's not the case and I know that's not the case. It's just a thought that goes through my mind sometimes. But <laughs> that's besides the point though. There are so many types of girls and so many types of people that there is no most girls. But I think going back to this whole I'm not like most girls line. What are you trying to say? Like, are you trying to say that you don't have a vagina? Do you not experience a period every month? Because yeah, that happens to most girls. And if you identify yourself as a girl and you don't do that, then heck yeah, you're not like most girls. But still, that's not what they mean in a lot of these cases. There might be some reasoning like, oh, they're just so madly in love that the guy has to say, oh, you're not like most girls. But no, this one might be a little controversial, but just because you're in love with this new person doesn't give you the right to like totally dash your last relationship. I had to replace my SD card because it got full, so I don't know where I left off. But let's just go into another reason why I don't like this line. We've looked at the whole, okay, other girls exist and they're not just mindless robots point of view but then also let's look at this from another point of view what's so bad about being like most girls so what if I do like Taylor Swift and I'm not ready to charge right into battle and defeat an entire army just because my one brother died or what if someone else likes makeup and they do care about their looks is that really a bad thing because what you're saying is oh if you're not like this one chick that's different from everyone else then you fall into this other category of everyone else and they're inferior to this one girl that's different. I shouldn't, other girls shouldn't, and just everyone shouldn't be devalued for not doing what this one person does. And when you're saying that you're different from me and you're better than me for doing this one thing, then that's honestly really insulting. <laughs> Their entire being is a unique personality trait. So you shouldn't just call them everyone else for liking what other people like because me personally I jump on a bandwagon so quick like I am on the Oregon Trail 24-7 and now we're gonna jump the gun again here's another reason I don't like that line why is it that when a girl is not like other girls she's a certain personality trait like I said before she's ready to charge into battle because she needs to get revenge for her brother well why is that the one defining trait why are they always snarky or sassy or funny or super intelligent or they don't care about their looks what about the other people that do care about their looks what about the people who aren't funny because the personality traits that you're putting down I have those I'm not the smartest person in my class what does that mean for me because I'm here and these other people are here so what what how am I supposed to take this we all have different personality traits and we shouldn't be put down because we don't follow a specific one so yeah thanks for watching bye